This system will enable communities to use a single water meter and their bills will be paid through their community leaders. The purpose of introducing this system is to allow constant water supply into settlements and villages. General Manager, Government and Community Relations for Water PNG Limited, Hong Kiap, revealed that the current water supply system installed in settlements and villages do not allow water to run constantly because they do not pay their bills. Hence, water supply comes at a certain time. However, the water farm system will enable water to flow uninterruptedly as long as every household in the community pay for the amount of water they use. Water is very, very cheap. Water is cheap, and if you have a meter, it will be more cheaper than you buying water on the street. You are buying a 20-liter cherry can with five cannon. But if you have a meter, you will get 1,000 liters of water with only one can of 50 toy. But at the village rate, you will have 1,000 liters paid for only one can. And that is how cheap water is, and we don't realize it. Mr. Kiap said such project is a first of its kind and Water PNG Limited will roll out similar projects to other non-revenue areas in the nation's capital if this pilot project is successful. The launching of the water farming project took place last Friday at Mirigini Community in Hanwabada village in the nation's capital. According to Kiap, work on this project will commence tomorrow, Monday the 12th of February 2024. Gladys Killer, National MTV News. Thank you.